guys thank goodness it's friday like oh my word i can't wait for this work day to be over um got loads of rotors to make sure they go out on the post um my manager's not here today um absolutely panic so i just want this day over and done with um had enough <laughs> i've had enough of today i don't even really have any plans for after work um i was supposed to see shay because he is off today and he's actually off tomorrow but he is now not feeling very well so i don't know if i'll see him if i won't see him it's majorly depressing because we don't normally have a lot of time off um we're off at the same time um so i'm a little bit gutted guys I'm not gonna lie to you I'm, if i actually think about it i think i might cry um so yeah as you see um we put the office christmas tree up yesterday um i've had a few people ask me when i'm putting my christmas tree up and um i don't know because my mum and my brother have basically had an argument um so there's a little bit of tension in the house at the moment um they've sort of fallen out and we normally my mum and my brother normally go up in the loft and get all the boxes down together and obviously yeah we normally send my brother up in the loft i'm not very secure on the loft ladder um so we normally send him up but i don't know if that's going to happen so goodness knows when we're going to put the tree up um it's normally well up by now so i'm a little bit glad that it's not everyone else i know has their tree up so it's friday night and i'm once again at home surprise surprise um to be f on my like behalf like i was originally gonna have plans those plans now aren't gonna come to fruition so what am i supposed to do um I can't even call Beth and say let's go out for a drink because it's her work's Christmas do. So I just kind of feel abandoned right now, guys. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, I've just filmed, finally, on the 9th of December, my November reading wrap-up. Um, I've been really lax in doing it. I know because I know why. Because I thought it was pointless. Because I only finished one book and the other one is the Gone with the Wind buddy read, which is still ongoing. So it's like yeah not a great performance but i've just recorded that just about to upload that then i've got to upload the footage from yesterday put that together um the one from west key um on wednesday oh my god there were so many clips from that and they took forever to upload took forever to put together um yeah that one took ages it didn't go up until like late last night because it just seemed to take forever um but i really enjoyed that that's probably been like my favorite day of vlogmas so far because i actually went somewhere but now that i'm kind of at a loss really um i think i might watch a film but then i have to choose what film and i just don't know what to watch guys i really don't know what to watch um i'm tempted to watch suicide squad again because i freaking loved that film guys um mainly for harlequin and the joker but i loved it but then I've also got Finding Dory, which I haven't seen yet. I've got Pete's Dragon, the remake. Also haven't seen that yet. And um, I haven't seen Me, Earl and the Dying Girl. Um, I recently picked that up because I hadn't seen it anywhere. Um, and they, I went into Asda the other day and it was there. And I was like, oh, let's buy that. Um, so yeah, I've got plenty of choices. <laughs> I just don't know what I feel like watching. Um, so yeah i might wrap a couple of christmas presents tomorrow because even though i've done most of my christmas wrapping i can't be bothered to do it tonight um even though i've done the bulk of my christmas wrapping i've bought a couple of other things since like i've bought shay's um dad and sister a little something um and what else have i purchased since oh i picked up something else for my granddad um just little bits really but I don't know whether to do them or to wait until I'm then completely finished. I don't know. I don't know. Ah, December, how I love thee. So, I don't know what to watch. Tell me, guys. I don't know why I'm asking you to tell me because by the time you suggest something, I'll have already decided on what to watch. So, <sighs> woohoo. Day nine in the beauty advent calendar. Oh, 
have a, oh, okay, we have another lipstick. Yeah, which is quite a similar colour, wouldn't you say, to that? They don't have colours actually on the bottom, but they look like exactly the same. Okay, they are slightly different, but I mean, slightly, you won't be able to tell in this like really poor and natural light, but like the difference between them is really minuscule, but the nude, neutral, natural colours um, are my kind of like thing, I wear these all the time, so these are two lipstick colours that I will absolutely get a lot of wear out of. Okay, day nine in our Disney one is another dinky one up here Ooh. oh this one's super cute if I can get it out it is it looks like a little Marie from the Aristocats bear with me a second I will take her out of her packaging yeah we have little Marie from the Aristocats and she's so pretty look at her I love her Hey, so it's like half past 11 at night and I've got ready for bed. In the end, I couldn't decide what film to watch. So um, while I was uploading and like editing um, videos and stuff, I just put on crime documentaries in the background. I love crime documentaries. I'm watching um, a series called A Town and Country Murder, which I've already seen before, but not for like a year maybe a year and a half so I'm re-watching that um, you know while I'm pottering around doing other things so yeah my eyes gone quite red I don't know why I mean I have sensitive eyes anyway so there's no like reason for it to go red it's just gone red um, tiredness probably doesn't help so I'm just gonna finish watching this episode which is what another 20 minutes and then I think I'm just gonna go to bed actually while I've got you guys um, does anyone know of any, um, I don't want to say cures, but yeah, cures for mouth ulcers. I've got a really, really bad one at the moment. I've got a liquid antiseptic called Ambisol, which normally works really well. Um, but it hasn't really budged this one yet anyway. And I know about like rinsing your mouth out with so salt water. Just wondered if anyone else knew of anything to get rid of them because this one's causing me quite a lot of pain because it's literally right here. Um, so it's like, yeah, it's just really painful. So yeah, I'll end this, this day's vlog on that wonderful, wonderful note. Um, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.